Hi everybody, it's Miss Heather here with our craft for the week. This week we're making elephants and our elephant have waving trunks. So follow along with me to make an elephant of your very own at home. All right, let's get started. What we'll need to make this is two dark blue half circles, one light blue circle, one light blue strip of paper, two small black circles, and two medium sized white circles. You'll also need a straw. And if you got your kit from the library, all of these things will be in your kit. And what you'll need to have at your house is glue stick and some tape. Now, if you are making this video after kits or if you didn't get a library kit, the way I made all of these pieces was really easy. For the big circle, I just traced a plate and cut that out. Then I did the same thing to get my half circles. I traced a plate, then folded that paper in half and cut it to get two half circles. I cut a strip of another piece of blue construction paper about two inches wide. It doesn't really have to be a specific length. For the tiny black circles, I traced a bottle cap and for the bigger uh, white circles, I trace the bottom of a cup. So these are all simple shapes that you can make at home. So to make our elephant, once we have all our pieces, we're going to take our glue and put a little bit on the top corner of one ear. And we're gonna stick that ear on like that. Then, we're gonna put some glue on the top of our other ear and put that on like that. I found that I like them better a little spaced out. You might like them better if they're closer together, but I think I like mine like this. There we go. Then we're going to attach our eyes. So we're going to put some glue on our white circle and put it right here. And some glue on our other white circle and put it next to that one. And we're gonna take our black circles and put some glue on there and stick it in the middle of a white circle. And then we're gonna take our other black circle and do the exact same thing. And there's the start of our elephant, but he needs a trunk. So we will take our, our piece of blue paper and we're gonna roll it Roll it, roll it, roll it. Almost all the way up. We're gonna roll it into a nice little tube. Almost all the way up so that it's curly and it'll look like this. And then we take our curled up part and this part is a little important moms and dads and other grown-ups we want to put some glue on the side where if you put it down you want the glue on the side that the curl curls up towards because we want the curly part facing backwards when we glue it onto our elephant and there he has or she has they have a trunk and now we need to make that trunk move so we're gonna flip this over we're gonna take our straw and we're gonna leave enough room at the top 
for us to blow into and line up our straw with our trunk and we're going to tape down our straw onto the back of our elephant. And then, if I blow in the straw, his trunk moves. And you can then color your elephant if you want to. You can give him more of a face. You can give him some eyelashes or you can color his ears. But that is how you make an elephant with a waving trunk. I'll see you later. Bye.